If y'all been supporting me for a while, y'all already know who Erica Love is. Sis is a vet at this. She knows exactly what to do to get people in tune. And that's mentioned the Prince family. They really ain't got nothing to do with this, but now they in it. Damien Prince's father, Damien Cry, he's the problem. And so is his baby mother, Erica. They broke up early this year. They've been having problems, DNA, cheating. They really wasn't supposed to be together. This was a relationship that started based off of money and ended up with a child. A recipe for disaster. But they decided to go their own separate ways. Erica started dating the Mucker family. Family. Damien Cryer started dating Latoya. He actually asked her hand in marriage. So they supposedly supposed to be engaged, but just go with it. Anyway, so they're separated. They're supposed to be happy. You would think less drama. No. Erica is supposed to be dating the Mucker family, AKA Rican. But while they're doing videos, she decided to look at the comments. Now people are saying, oh, it looks like he's not into you. He's turned off. He's using you for his real estate business. And I'm like, these supporters must not know who Erica is. Everything she do is for views, but she decides to listen to the audience and break up with him. So now she's unhappy, bored with no material. So what does she have to do now? She has to go back to Damien Cryer and start some shit. She knew exactly what she was doing when she posted this. She said, send those prayers up. Kim been extremely sick since Friday, high fever, coughing, etc. And sadly, I can't take him to the doctor because they won't let me bring Dion inside. Dion is the Prince Cryer and her son. Bear with me guys, I'll drop these videos whenever I can. So of course Damien Cryer is gonna respond. He said, this chick is trying to make me look bad on the internet about my son, but won't make the guy who physically her look bad. Then he responded to a comment. Somebody said, you don't have the response to criticism. You guys are too blessed for that. Let people say what they're going to and keep it moving. Dave Man Cryer responded, how you gonna let someone abuse you but won't talk about that but run to the internet because I can't get my child today this chick is messy so Erica takes the social media because he says it twice that the Mucker family put his hands on her so she says I'm only speaking on this because lies travel quicker than true believe whatever you want because it's the incident and things will get mixed up the Mucker family never beat me and I never said he beat me I'm tired of people believing whatever flies out someone's mouth at this point it's and make whatever video you like keep spreading lies because I get it when someone gets pissed off they want everyone to feel the same and just like any other situation this will blow over and I'm covered by God I won't be addressing this anymore to my true supporters. Thank you. Good night. So now Latoya, Damien Cryer's fiance, feel the need to jump in and defend her fiance. So she says, Damien Cryer is not lying. This girl has called many a times in text and we were together and she says she got choked. She is sitting in Mucker's driveway and feels and then she's getting beat. I have had a heart to heart with this girl and told her she needs to focus on herself and her kids. What is the reason for bringing drama to YouTube saying that you have been beaten by a man is nothing to play with because I've been beaten. God is definitely watching and all of your lives will catch up to you, sweetheart. She really needs prayer and guidance. So now Damien Cryer has brought the Mucker family in it by saying that he put hands on Erica. Latoya defended the statement. So now Erica feel the need that, okay, I gotta tear this man down by any means necessary. And this is when all these videos come out. The first video she did, she bought a clip of her and Damien arguing. I don't know when this happened. Like I said, things will happen behind the scenes and then she'll hold on to all this footage and wait until one moment where he mess up and then she'll make a video and throw all these receipts in. So I don't know when exactly this took place, but supposedly they were arguing. He was trying to get her out the house because she was disrespecting his house. She wouldn't leave. So she started screaming and hollering and it makes it look like he's literally putting hands on her, but really he's just trying to push her out and get her out the house. That's in the first video and after she plays that video she says well the mother family is not putting hands on me Damien Cryer is putting hands on me what if you're confused she said the reason why she told Damien Cryer that the mother family was putting hands on her is because she thought that would make Damien Cryer want to take his son more so you lied on the mother family about putting hands on you so Damien Cryer could take his son more what this is all the things she said in the first video so now this video doesn't work people are confused people don't understand what's going on why would you say that this man put hands on you just so another man could take his child and now you're saying that the person that you want to take your child is the real person that put hands on you so now you sending your child to a person that put hands on you so now people are confused they're making videos they like what is she talking about this sounds crazy so now she got to quickly change the narrative because everybody's confused as to why you're putting your child in danger because you're saying both these men put hands on you so now this is how the prince family got involved because now she has to change the narrative of what her real excuse was now she got to make it seem like Damien Cryer is talking crap about his first son, Damien Prince. So that's why she posted up this video. That video he put out there, it don't mean shit to me. It doesn't mean shit. Because that video is not something that's happened. He did have a video on the chamber. He put a lights around. It's YouTube. They make it look the way that it looks, but it's not what it is. They got lights over there. Yeah, you can see the 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 lights over there. Yeah, you can see a block apart from each other with power, fully furnished, millions of dollars. 
But yeah, he doesn't pick up in his career. We don't give a fuck about him with a fucking dog. That doesn't make sense to me. Because I moved down here for them, for their asses. I moved and left my job and my life for them. You know, so I understand what you're saying. But cuz, don't believe everything that you see on YouTube. Everything is just for entertainment. If something was really that wrong with that, you know, you would pick the wrong with all people. What kind of shit is that? You know, we we do want messy shit that you shouldn't be doing. Bond is five doors strong. He comes over and get him, his girl, and his dog. I get into it. I don't go over there and say, oh, we eat shit over there. I tell him, work this shit out. I get up over there and work this shit out now. I don't want to fucking hear it. I tell him, both of their fans and subscribers drop the video about it. I'm quite sure they see my video. I'm 50. I'm not kissing nobody. And see, that's the problem with being him right now. That's the problem with being him. That's the reason why being him is not speaking right now. That's the reason why he stopped speaking to me. When him and his wife fall out, I don't go over there telling him, oh, don't do this, Damon. He's got to keep him up here for a reason. I ain't said shit to nobody about that. The reason why. And I won't. But he has to keep him up here for a reason. But I don't want him and his wife to do it. I don't go over there and say, oh, he eat shit or Damon. I tell him, work this shit out. I get up over there. Work this shit out now. I don't want to fucking hear it. Fuck that YouTube, fuck that internet shit. They talk to me. I'm the one who broke your ass. Not YouTube. Crazy, man. Crazy, man. So after she posted that video of Damien Cryer talking about his son Damien Prince, Damien Prince responds, he said, elevation requires separation. The thing about smart people, they sound crazy to dumb people. Oh yes, the past can hurt, but the way I see it, you can either run from it or learn from it. Ciao, this girl here. Clearly Damien Prince was not phased by the video that Erica posted because he invited his father Damien Cryer to their daughter's first birthday. So he was at the first birthday. So they have no issues. There's no problems between them two. He's not even thinking about her. He said in the past that he does doesn't pay this girl any mind. He's not giving her the exposure that she wants. So I don't know why she keep mentioning the Prince family, but hopefully this is my last video. I just wanted to clear up how the Prince family even got involved in this situation real quick. Y'all leave y'all comments down below. Let me know what y'all thinking. Until next time, peace.